Hi, Louis here, and in today's video, I'm going to review Pimsleur uh, Italian. So this is a Pimsleur Italian review. And essentially, the three questions I'm going to be answering, as always, are uh, is Pimsleur Italian worth it? That is, are you going to get fluent with Pimsleur Italian? Uh, what can you expect? What level can you expect with Pimsleur Italian at the end of the program, at the end of the five levels? And what time investment is required from you to get to, to that level? And, uh, you know, finally, I'm going to talk about how can you get the best price possible for Pimsleur Italian? Because Pimsleur Italian is actually pretty expensive. If you go on the Pimsleur website right now, you will see that Pimsleur Italian, the five levels, it's going to cost you $575 for the whole course. Very, very expensive. So, you know, I'm going to touch on this right now uh, really quickly, but I'm going to talk about it later in the video. So essentially what you can do is there's an other plan which is not advertised on the Pimsleur website. Website. If you want to get Pimsleur Italian, you can just click the link in the description below and you're going to get a free trial for Pimsleur Italian. And later on, if you decide that it's for you, then you can actually just pay around $15 to $20 uh, monthly for Pimsleur Italian. So in total, that's going to be five months. The entire program, that's going to be $100 instead of uh, $575 for the, the five levels. So a lot less expensive. All right. Now, let me talk about uh, Pimsleur first, a very short introduction of what you can expect if you actually decide that Pimsleur Italian is the right way for you to study. So Pimsleur Italian is a five level course where essentially you're going to have one lesson a day. Every single lesson is 30 minutes and it's going to last for 150 days, you know, 150 lessons. Each level is 30 lessons, so about a month. And essentially it's predominantly an audio course. As a matter of fact, the way I use it, it's 100% an audio course because, you know, uh, originally Pimsleur is actually um, an audio course 100%, but they have added some, you know, some little uh, features. There's an app, there's a web platform, but I don't personally use them. So every single day while you're commuting, while you're jogging, you're just going to put your earphones in and you're going to be listening listening to and participating to a lesson which is based around a conversation between two um, Italian uh, native speakers. So they're going to have a conversation, you're going to listen to it in the beginning, and then an English speaker is going to explain to you the pronunciation points, uh, the vocabulary stuff, uh, and you know, all of these things, and progressively make it so that at the end of the lesson, at the end of the 30 minutes, you're going to be participating in that conversation. You're going to be talking in the conversation. And uh, so, so that's basically what Pimsleur is. Now, to answer the, th the first question, which is, is Pimsleur Italian worth it? You know, are you going to get fluent using, using Pimsleur Italian? And my, my answer is definitely yes, it's definitely worth it. I'm gonna talk about um, what kind of level you can reach if you go through the five levels a little bit later, but let me explain you uh, to you why it's actually worth it. And basically, just generally speaking, Pimsleur Italian is very, very good in the sense that it respects a lot of the scientific principles of you know effective language learning. And this is mainly because you know Pimsleur was named after Dr. Paul Pimsleur, which was a uh, he was a researcher in applied linguistics. So this is why it's you know scientific, scientifically sort of uh, built. But so one of the reasons why it's so effective is because it allows you to have spaced repetition. And if you're new to my channel, then you don't know what spaced repetition is. And spaced repetition is just a learning principle, just not just for language learning, where, you know, if you want to learn one item, say, you know, one word of vocabulary or one grammatical rule or a pronunciation sort of pattern, then it's not enough just to learn it once and then maybe review it once, uh, you know, another time in the future. It's not enough. You need to have multiple repetitions of that same item, you know, using strategic points in time. And this is exactly what Pimsleur do. So they, uh, you know, they're going to introduce you to a specific phrase or vocabulary or grammatical rule, whatever it is, on day one, then they're going to make you review it on day two, and then the same thing on day four, and then a week after, two weeks after, a month after. You get the point. Uh, so there are intervals like this, which allow you to have 
repetitions that are spaced. In the beginning, they're very frequent, and then they get more and more spaced. And you know, spaced repetition is basically the most studied uh, scientific principle for language learning. It just works. I mean, there, there's nothing to add. It just works. And this is one of the big factors uh, that, you know, um, why th this is one of the, the big reasons why PIMSLR is so effective. The second reason why PIMSLR is so effective is because you're participating in the lessons. So you're not just, you know, recognizing, like listening to an audio lesson. You're the English, uh, the native speaker, the English native speaker, the American guy is actually going to prompt you to participate. He's going to tell you, well, uh, you know, how do you say this? in uh, Italian or how do you uh, you know how do you respond to this in Italian and so on and so what this allows you to do is to get some recall so you are forced to recall information that you have heard in uh, in past lessons or in the current lesson and this allows for a much deeper level of mental processing than if you were just you know listening to a lesson passively so essentially Depth of mental processing means how, if, how, essentially how deep is the information going to be engraved in your brain. If you just listen to a lesson, if you just listen to a lecture, you know, I'm, I'm sure you've had this experience. You go to a classroom, you listen to information, and on the following day, just that information is, uh, you know, a little bit, you know, uh, fuzzy or it's just basically gone. And with Pimsleur, that's not going to happen because number one, space repetition, and number two, you're forced to recall things, which has been proven by scientific studies to actually make the information last for a lot longer than if you were just to recognize them. And Pimsleur is based around that principle of participation. You're participating in those lessons. All right. Now, the third reason and the final reason why Pimsleur is so effective is because uh, it's pretty passive. Well, it's not passive, you're actually participating, but it's passive in the sense that you don't need to invest your own time in the lessons. So you just put your earphones in while you're commuting, while you're jogging, while you're you know, working out, cleaning the house, and that's basically it. You don't need to actively sit down and study with a textbook. And you know, let's face it, a lot of people actually fail at language learning because they don't have time, they don't want to make the time, and so you know, they just give up. It's just a time investment question. With Pimsleur, it actually fits right into your life. You don't need to you know, invest some active time into studying. And it may sound a little bit simplistic, to say that you know that's why PIMS are so effective, but you know that's the truth. If you don't want to invest any time into studying, then PIMSLR is for you. This is the only course that allows you 100% to not sit down and just you know study while you're doing something else. All right, now let me talk about the second question, which is um, what kind of level can you expect with PIMSLR Italian at the end of the five levels and how much time is it gonna take? So first of all, how much time is it going to take to actually complete the whole program? Well, as I said, there are five levels. Every single level has 30, le 30 lessons and you're expected to do one lesson a day. It's organized in that way. So it's going to be 150 lessons, 150 days. So that's about uh, you know five months essentially to get to the final level. Now, what kind of final level are we talking about? Well, every single level of Pimsleur is going to provide you with about 300 to 400 new words. And uh, so if we cut the apple in half, that's, gonna, that's going to be about 400 new words per level. And so with five levels, that's gonna be two thousand new words at the end of the program that you know that you have remembered very well and that you can use in a conversation uh, because of space repetition and a deep level of mental processing and so excuse me I dropped my phone but yes yeah, so 2,000 new words at the end of the program and this is these are going to be essentially the 2,000 most common words in the Italian language now if you look at scientific studies you will see that for the English language the 2,000 most uh, common words in the English language compose about 90% of all the words that you will find 
in any spoken conversation. And the same can, can be said, you know, probably I'm guessing for Italian. So the 2000 most common words in Italian will occur, will make up about 90% of all the words in a spoken conversation between two Italian uh, native speakers. So what this means is that at the end of the program, you will be about to understand about 90% of all of those words in spoken conversations, okay? And to give you an idea of what kind of level this is, this is definitely a level where you can speak confidently with uh, you know, uh, native speakers. In Italy, you're definitely not going to be able to talk about you know, politics or science or any kind of stuff like that, but you can have very good conversations, no doubt about this. And um, you know, it's about a B1 level, so using the European framework for you know, language fluency, it's B1, which a lot of people after years of studying languages at school do not reach. But with Pimsleur, because it's organized and it's so well engineered and you know, you're pretty much guaranteed that you're going to succeed because you're, you don't have to invest your own time, you're going to reach this level very, very quickly. So. You can actually, you know, if you took Italian in school, maybe some of you did, then uh, you'll see how much more effective uh, it actually is. In five months, you can reach a B1 level, very, very good level in Italian, very surprising. All right, now let me talk about the third question, which is how do you get the best price possible for Pimsleur Italian? And it's pretty simple. You know, if you go to the Pimsleur website right now, uh, you will see that for the five levels of Pimsleur Italian, you're gonna pay $575. That's a lot of money. And even at this price point in, my po in my opinion, it's worth it. If you were to purchase the course at that price point, uh, it would be more effective than actually going, you know, uh, getting a university course in Italian because Pimsleur is so practical, it's so effective. Um, now, what you can do, you don't need to buy it at that price point. There's a link in the description of this video, which is going to uh, get you to a page on the Pimsleur website, which is not advertised on their website. It's kind of hidden and it's going to enable you to get a free trial and then later on actually benefit from a much cheaper plan. So essentially it's a subscription plan. Instead of paying for you know the entire course, $575, you're going to pay for, uh, I think it's 50 15 or $20 uh, monthly that you're going to pay for a subscription and you get all of the benefits, you know, it's all access. It's the same thing as if you actually bought the, the $575 course. So it's 15 to $20 monthly and you get all access to Pimsleur Italian. And that's basically it. So it's pretty cheap. Uh, check out the link in the description. And I would really want to know if uh, you know what your opinion on Pimsleur Italian is. If you actually complete the five months, then please post a comment in the comment section below. And that's pretty much it. I'll see you in the next one.